Hello friends, this is Pratik Sinha from Alt News. Yesterday we saw that RBI finally put out its annual report and it was covered by multiple media organizations, especially print media, uh, where we were told that 99% of the demonetized currency is back with RBI. And following this announcement, there was widespread condemnation of Mr. Modi's demonetization move, which he had announced on November 8, 2016. Looking at the widespread condemnation, you know, BJP IT cell thought that it is time to balance the propaganda and they came up with a hashtag called demonetization success. Since this afternoon, demonetization success has been the number one trend for many hours. And uh, we saw that multiple ministers and MLAs and MPs tweeted using this hashtag. But at Alt News, we observed certain strange trends and we started investigating. So let's see. Um, now here is a list of all the verified accounts who are using the demonetization success hashtag and tweeting it. Uh, Rao Inderjeet Singh being the Minister of Parliament from Gurugram. Then we have Ministry of Women and Child Development tweeting about it. We have Menka Gandhi, who's the Union Minister for Women and Child Development tweeting about it. And uh, finally we came to an interesting set of tweets by Mr. Karaj Mishra. Now, if you see, he has tweeted continuously about demonetization success. And uh, if you look at the first tweet, it is at 438. If you look at the second tweet, it is again at 438. If you look at the third tweet, it is again at 438. If you look at the fourth tweet, it is at 439. So he's tweeting multiple times per minute. Now, even Twitter experts, you know, who are on Twitter all day, they find it hard to tweet so fast. So is Mr. Kalraj Mishra really tweeting typing the tweets on his own or is there somebody who's who has access to his Twitter account and is simply copy pasting tweets and it seems more likely that somebody actually has access to his account. So we investigated some more and we came across this person. His name is Yogesh Malik and uh, who's Yogesh Malik? Yogesh Malik says that he's a Namo volunteer team member BJP IT cell, earlier managed Modi for PM Fund 2014. In his cover image, he also has a picture with Mr. Modi. So we saw that he has shared one specific document, Google Doc. And when we open that Google Doc, what we see that you know, the title says trend alert demonetization success. It says that it is supposed to be at th on 31st August time 4.30 p.m. Now, we just saw that uh, Mr. Kalraj Mishra had started tweeting at about 4.38 p.m. While if you go down, uh, Mr. Rao Inderjit Singh had started tweeting at 4.33 p.m. So that is exactly three minutes after this document claims that the trend should start. And if you look at the tweets, uh, let's jump to the Hindi tweets first. There are, first there are a bunch of English tweets and then there are Hindi tweets. Uh, you'll see, you know, tweets like 2011617. You know, there's a spelling mistake here. Uh, instead of 2016-17, uh, there's 2011617. If you look at that tweet, may I call ne 13716 crore rupee ki ka Now, if we go back to the tweets that Mr. Kalraj Mishra sent out, and if you look at the tweets, um, yeah, here, this tweet, you see has made the same spelling mistake to 2016617 na aikar me, And if you look at all his other tweets, now let's look at another tweet. Let's say this one. Aikar ke chape mari se 2016-2017 mein logo ne 15497 crore rupee ki aghoshit aay ko logo swikar kiya. And if you look at the trend of the document, uh, 
you saw, you see that that doc, that tweet is right here. So essentially, every tweet that has been sent out is actually listed. You know, with the demonetization success, it has been listed here. And basically, social media uh, teams of these ministers who have direct access to all these accounts, they have simply copy pasted these tweets. Now, for example. Anand Kumar, a phenomenal rise in new individual taxpayers from 22 lakh last year to 56 lakhs. Okay, let's go back to the trend account and uh, look for 22 lakh. You know, and here there's a tweet, a phenomenal rise in new individual taxpayers from 22 lakhs last year to 56 lakhs. So essentially, all these ministers are have teams or is it it's a single team, it's difficult to say. But essentially, they are tweeting tailor-made tweet, tweets which have already been put out in a document and everybody is supposed to tweet it. And it is not just BJP ministers tweeting it. The entire BJP infrastructure is tweeting the same tweets. So, for example, this is Nandita Thakur. And she's BJP Karyakarta, says she's an SM consultant. She has tweeted demonetization, attained the sub-objective of making India a less cash economy. That same tweet is here. Yeah. Oh, similarly, there are multiple people who are tweeting the same thing. And going back to the ministers, earlier we saw that Mr. Kalraj Mishra made that mistake of two zero zero one six one seven. Here is Mr. Kalash Vijayvargya who is making this mistake. And the same tweets are going on and on. Look at how fast Mr. Kalash Vijayvargya is tweeting. 921, 921. 922. So again, he's tweeting once per minute, which is essentially, it means that he's copy pasting tweets. So that is how uh, the union government actually trends tweets. That is, you know, make all the ministers use their social media presence uh, and, you know, basically copy paste tweets from a given document and make it appear that people are actually thinking that demonetization has been a success because these ministers have enormous social media reach and when they trend things together, then it obviously will become a number one trend, making people think that there are so many people who actually think that demonetization has been a success. Thank you very much.